Hello everybody and welcome to another segment of Andrew Media Tutorials. I was working on a project that was about 12 minutes long and when trying to encode it the process would come to a halt and the crash error message would appear. I went online and did some research as I always do and found out that it was a very common problem among the community. I tried many things described in all kinds of posts yet to my demise nothing worked. It went from titler DLLs to the number of cores the computer was running. I even uninstalled and reinstalled the program, but no such luck. This went on for days. The odd thing, however, was that the video encoding would always stop in the same part of the video every time. Another thing I noticed was that this problem would happen to people with videos that went over 8 minutes or so. Well, I thought to myself and decided I would try to render the video piece by piece and try to isolate the problem. Well, my friends, this is what this tutorial is all about. Here we have the video I previously mentioned in its fully edited glory. I will try to render the video as a whole to show you the error. We export. And once Anker is open, with the video ready for render, we click start. We'll pick up at the scene of the crime. Well, as expected, the error came up. Now this is an ugly one because it doesn't offer you much insight as to why it happened. Well, let's close it out and proceed to my solution. Like I said earlier, we will render the video piece by piece. Make the different pieces be about a minute to a minute and a half long. By doing this, I exported the different pieces and the error would not occur, thus allowing me to proceed to my next step. When we have all the pieces rendered, bring them all back to Premiere and set them up accordingly. With all the pieces in place, now you're ready for render. Now, this solved my problem. Let me know how it helped you. Until next time, thank you for watching Andrew Media Tutorials.